In this video, I'll talk about the two blocks where they are on top of each other and a force is applied. Now, we are interested in finding out the magnitude of the force that is acting onto the, the top mass. So, how are we going to do it? So, as the two blocks, these two blocks are connected together, but what we assume here, there's no friction force in between. And let's say th these two are connected, uh, these two are connected either by a glue or a nail or something. And we again ignoring all the friction forces. So when the two blocks are connected together and a force is applied, the two blocks or the system moves with the same acceleration. So let's find out the system acceleration. The acceleration of the system can be given by force divided by the total mass, m1 and m2. So the mass of the first object is 15 kilogram, the second object is five kilogram, and what you get the acceleration is one meter per second square. That means both mass move with the, the same acceleration. Now we know the acceleration of this of this mass now and and we know the mass as well so how much force is now needed so the force required to move this mass is five mass time acceleration and the mass is five kilogram and the acceleration is one we just calculated this one so force is 15 newton so that means when you apply a 20 newton force and the both masses are moving the force distribute itself in such a way that the only five, five Newton is acting here and the 15 Newton is acting onto these two masses. And the entire system moves with an acceleration of one meter per second square. And the direction of the force again is in the same direction here. So that's it, it's a pretty straightforward thing. So again, if you have any questions or comments, write down in the comment section below. And at the end, do not forget to like, share, and subscribe the channel. Thank you very much.